Hi there, this is Natasha. I'm a crochet tutor and designer at My Creative Butterfly. I teach crochet through my courses, classes and patterns not just as a hobby but also as a tool that will help you become more mindful in everything that you do in your day-to-day -day life. I have a crocheting experience of more than 25 years and I have taught over 5000 students globally. You can find me on all social media platforms by the name My Creative Butterfly. Welcome to my channel and if you like what you learned today, don't forget to like and subscribe. So in today's tutorial, I'll show you how to crochet these pretty miniature Della Lilies. These are very easy to do and a very quick project. This will make perfect last minute gifts. These are not just a decoration item. You can use these for making some very practical projects like earrings, brooch pins, charms or you can even make car decorations or small miniature wreaths for different purposes so use your creativity and use this pretty project for any uh, any kind of crochet project that you like so before we start with the actual tutorial let me show you the tools and materials that you'll need in order to create these pretty miniature color lilies of your own so you'll require very few materials to make these lilies so the first thing is the thread so i have used a size 8 Pearl cotton thread in two colors. Yellow is for making the center of the flower here and white is for making the petal. With this you will need a 6 mm crochet hook, uh, some floral tape, you will need some wire cutters for cutting off the wire for the stem. I have one long uh, wire for making the flower stem. This is a floral wire. It is neither very thick nor very thin, so you can choose any thickness as per your preference. Since Yellow Lily has a thicker stem, so I prefer to use a thicker wire. At this, you'll also need some fabric glue or any good quality glue for uh, assembling the flower. So that's about it. This is all. Sorry about the dogs. So. This is all the tools and materials that you'll need to create the Yellow Lilies. Now let us see how to actually crochet the flowers. So now that you are clear about the tools and materials that you'll need to create the miniature calla lilies, let us see how to actually crochet it. So it is a pretty simple and quick pattern. I'll just quickly show you. You just need to crochet one part of the lily that is this, this one big petal that is there. The rest of it is simple wrapping of the yarn so you don't need to crochet anything for that. The assembly also is very easy. I'll show you that also step by step in details. So let us see how to do the petal. So we are going to start the petal with a slip knot. So just place a slip knot on your hook. Make sure it is nice and loose. Don't make it too tight. Otherwise it will be very difficult to do the rest part of the petal. Now after doing the slip knot, we will start with chain 4. So this is 1, 2, 3 and 4. This forms the base of our petal. And now we are going to do the entire petal in the fourth chain from the hook that is this chain so to start with the petal do a triple crochet in the fourth chain from the hook so we'll do yarn over two times insert the hook in the fourth chain and we will complete the triple crochet stitch now we'll do one more triple crochet in the same chain as we did the previous one so again do a yarn over two times go in the same chain that is the fourth chain and complete one more triple crochet like this then do chain three this will be for doing the picot because we want the petal to be pointed now to complete the picot insert the hook under the front loop of the last triple crochet and this vertical bar here and do a slip stitch so with this the point of your petal is ready now to do the second half of the petal, I'll do two more triple crochets in the same chain. So this is your first triple crochet and do one more. So this is your second triple crochet. Now to finish the petal, do chain three, one, two and three. Now we'll do a slip stitch in the same chain as we just did the triple crochets like this. There you go. Our petal is ready. 
now we'll just cut off the thread leaving a very small tail around 2 to 3 inches like this just pull through this loop to secure the end and here your petal is ready now the crocheting part is done now let us see how to assemble the flower so for assembly we we'll first take the wire cut a very small piece from the wire around uh, 3 inches or so the length can vary as per your preference so here I have this small piece of wire now for making the center of the flower we'll use some fabric glue and the yellow thread so take the wire and on the uh, tip of the wire apply a little fabric glue around half to three fourth centimeters not more than that and make sure that it is slightly less don't apply too much otherwise it will become very messy now we'll just just wrap the yellow thread on the tip of the wire like this just follow the video to see how to apply it it can be slightly tricky but don't worry you'll get there I'm really sorry about the dogs so once you are done with the wrapping just push the threads together so that there is no gap now the length of this yellow part should be around it should be around three fourths uh, times that of the petal so as you can see it is slightly shorter than the petal so this much is enough now we'll just cut off the extra yellow thread that we have here just cut it off now these ends that are here loose ends we are just going to glue them also so apply a little glue and just roll the wire like this on your finger so that's it the center is ready now don't worry it is fabric glue or any glue that you will use it will become transparent once it dries so don't worry about it right now now to assemble the petal to this I'll just pass it through the center here, the central hole in the petal and push the petal till the top like this. There you go. Now to finish it off, just take the floral tape. I'll just stretch it a little so to activate the glue and I'm just going to wrap it starting right at the base of the petal and we are going to take these two tails also uh, with the stem. We are going to wrap it with the floral tape. So that we don't have to weave it in now just put it here at the base and pinch it between fin your fingers like this and keep wrapping it till the end and you go once you reach the end don't cut off the floral tape just rip it off like this and here your flower is ready just shape the petal a little with your fingers i'm just going to cut off the extra floral tape and the thread if you want you can adjust the size of the wire also now I think it is too long I'll just cut off a small portion like so here it is you are done with it you can make as many as you want you can also make a miniature bouquet with this and as I mentioned in the beginning you can use it for multiple different projects so use your imagination and use it as per your wish so here you go your calla lily tutorial is finished i hope you enjoyed the tutorial and if you like what you learned today don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel i have a few more miniature uh, tutorials that i'll be linking in the end these are tutorials for miniature flowers like roses poppies so do check them out if you like miniatures and i hope you enjoyed the channel do not forget to subscribe and just reminding again and thank you so much for watching and happy crocheting bye bye